What's up guys, thanks for tuning in on today's video. I'm Gabe and today I'm going to be going over seven modifications for your 2010 through 2013 Camaro SS that are $50 and under. Uh, I'm really excited to share some of these modifications guys because modifying cars is pretty expensive and I just wanted to put together a compilation of some really inexpensive mods that won't drastically change the performance output of the car or drastically change the entire exterior like let's say a wide body kit or something like that but instead it will actually give your car some flair and also will differentiate it from other Camaros and of course the stock look. I also want to include guys that not only are these modifications extremely inexpensive and are very affordable but they're also extremely easy to install maximum installation time on one of these mods could be about an hour at most and just a reminder guys some of these modifications can be actually transferred over to the 2010 to 2013 camaro rs or the v6 model uh, but this is going to be mostly focused for the ss model in particular guys so let's go ahead and get started with the first one on the list all right guys so for the first modification for your fifth gen camaro ss 2010 to 2013 is actually going to be found in the front of the car and it's actually my most recent video on my 2010 Camaro SS and that is going to be the headlight tints right here that mod was about $19 or so now this mod is actually one of the mods that I've been wanting to do for the longest time but I never got around to doing it but when I decided to do it and installed it you guys can check out the video link in the description below or cards above you will see that it drastically changes the front of the car I mean really it really changed it from the stock very clear headlight design and of course the kit that I've included in the link in the description below not only comes with the headlight tint itself but also comes with the uh, emergency lights and the turning signal housing covers as well it also comes with the front side markers and the fog light uh, tints as well I actually already did the side marker tints a while back and I actually don't have any fog lights on my car because I deleted them. I also wanna mention that as a benefit to buying this modification, not only does it really transform the appearance of the car and is also very easy to install, it also provides a layer of protection for your headlight and of course some of these sensitive parts here from rock chip or any other debris that you might find on the road. If it helps it look really cool, helps protect it and is really inexpensive, <laughs> that's a good mod. All right guys, so for the second modification for your 2010 through 2013 Camaro SS or even RS uh, for $50 and under is going to be this uh, Chevy Bowtie Delete Badge Insert. And that's actually gonna go right here uh, where the bow tie is. And of course the purpose of this is to uh, really replace the area that is gonna be left behind uh, by removing this uh, bow tie here. Just as an FYI guys, this is not gonna be a permanent modification for me. I actually just bought this for the purpose of this video. I'm going to be doing some other modifications to the front of the car. You guys will see it in later videos. This one in particular, I got it for $29.99 on uh, Amazon. I went with Amazon just because it's a little bit more reputable and their policies are a lot more favorable uh, for buyers than they are for sellers on Amazon. So I went with them. Uh, link in the description below. And this modification is a great way to kind of get into that whole blacking out, de-chroming, de-badging, you know, if you want to be under the radar. Uh, and the modification is really easy to install. Let me go ahead and show you guys how it looks. So what you guys are going to want to do is really just slide two fingers. You're going to feel the clamps, pull down, and start pushing out. All right, there you go. It's starting to come out. That's how the bow tie looks like. This is how the grill looks like without the bow tie. Kind of nasty. So you'll go ahead and get this insert here and, and it fits right into place here. So as you guys can see, it completely transformed the front of the car before you had this really bright and beautiful bow tie. Uh, but now we went for a more sleeker, sportier, and kind of like more mysterious look. The actual insert itself is not 100% completely flush and that's because you know over the years this has probably molded um, you guys can see that there's a difference in color just because you know this is 
sun damage here it's dirtier in fact you can actually probably like hold this together with something and eventually it'll like mold into place uh, it does look really good actually i'm not gonna lie uh, I'm gonna enjoy this look for the next couple of weeks, but let's go ahead and continue with the next modification on our list. All right guys, so for the third modification that is $50 or under for your 2010 through 2013 Camaro SS, unfortunately this is only specific to the Camaro SS. That's going to be this uh, front valence. It's called the front valence blackout vinyl. And this is just, again, a, a piece of vinyl that uh, goes to the bottom part right here if my memory serves me correctly this was about 28 dollars or so i actually had this modification a couple years ago i used plasti dip for this look again it gives this kind of like a knockoff zl1 bumper type of look but it does give it that really nice black combo especially if you add a lip to the bottom like i have but when I decide to install this modification, and the reason why I haven't done it already is just because, well, I'm not sure if I'm gonna repaint my bumper. Uh, there's a lot of spider cracks that I have on it from an accident I had years ago that I never really addressed. But this vinyl is really good because not only will it give you that, that gloss black finish or that matte black look that you're looking for, but it also, like the headlights tints, it'll also give it a kind of like a protective layer for the paint. And again, it's vinyl, so you can always remove it at your own leisure. And actually, they have so many colors available. I think I saw like they had red, blue, uh, of course, matte black. And I actually don't see a lot of fifth gen Camaros with this vinyl or that type of paint design or that kind of exterior look. So you'll definitely look very unique. All right, guys, so for the fourth modification that you can do under 50 bucks, is actually not necessarily Camaro specific. So if you guys are driving another car or you know somebody that might uh, enjoy this modification, you guys will see just in a second here. And these are gonna be these Govi LED car lights. This is actually a really inexpensive mod. That's about $19 or so. Now this modification definitely changed the driving experience, not so much in the performance aspect of things, but really just the experience of driving it in the inside uh, it definitely gives this car a, a lot more flair on the inside kind of more of a festivity type of a feel I do have an installation video uh, link in the description below or cards above where you guys can see the installation process and how the application works the many features that come with this actual modification so if you guys are looking for something to give your interior on either your daily driver car another person's car or your own Camaro definitely check out this modification I definitely recommend it or even if you're not going to use the lights uh, you can always just kind of like turn it on and turn it back on with this little like button right here um, but definitely guys if you're looking for something to really spice up the interior of the car this is something that you guys have to get all right guys so for the fifth modification that you guys can do for $50 or under for your 2010 through 2013 Camaro SS or RS this is applicable to both of these is going to be the key fob replacement or uh, I guess key modification or swap this was about $14.99 uh, this is the key that is for the ones that have the remote startup you can buy the one that does not have it which is actually just kind of like a unified design here I put both of those link in the description below again the installation I do have a video on how to do it link in the description below cards above it was a pretty simple procedure to swap out the old key which by the way was horrendous I, I mine was just in such bad shape it was actually very grotesque to use I actually had to buy a, a key condom which is what I called it uh, for it because of how ugly and just how disgusting it was this key is significantly better just because of the material this is kind of like a plastic so it kind of has like a nice plastic clicky feedback and uh the old one was just i actually pushed it in because of the, it's like a rubbery material and i just it, it just was horrible guys that is a, a modification that doesn't really complement the exterior or interior experience like the previous modifications but it's something that Again, it's nice to feel and it's nice to look at. It looks like a brand new car type of thing. So again, 
really easy mod to do and really inexpensive to do so. All right, guys, so before I go ahead and finish off the rest of the mods on our list, I just wanna remind you guys to check out my Instagram below, GV Aspirated. Uh, there you can find some interactive stories like guess the car by the exhaust or any of my other stories that I do car votes for and a bunch of other content that I don't normally post on YouTube. You guys will have access to it if you guys give me a follow. And of course, that would be the best way to reach out to me through the DMs. All right, that's enough shout outs. Let's get back to the video. All right, guys, so for our sixth modification on our list, these are going to be the taillight tints for uh, the RS, ZL1, and the SS. So this is applicable to all of the trims available for the Camaro. Just like the taillights too, these were about $19. And this is actually one of my first modifications that I did to the car. So it's been with me since day one. Uh, but as you guys can see, it drastically changed the entire rear of the car. I'm not a big fan of red and blue put together like that, especially in the amount that the taillights had. So I went ahead and tinted that out, but I went with the darkest one because I actually do like to have really dark now uh, taillight tints on the Camaro. I think it looks absolutely menacing, especially with this black Z28 style spoiler. Uh, it looks just really, really nice. Overall, if you're trying to black out the car, this is definitely one of the modifications that you have to do for the rear of the car. The kit that I've actually included in the link in the description below do come with the rear side markers as well really useful and again extremely inexpensive and it has a drastic look on the rear part of your car all right guys so for the seventh and final mod that you guys could get for $50 or less it's going to be these tail light bezels that come in a matte black or gloss black finish these are $59 and they're from fast tech performance I'll be very honest with you guys I Kind of regret getting them just because $59 is quite a lot of money for a bunch of plastic pieces however I did have to get these just because well my old chrome bezeled ones are chipped right along here they look kind of bad and of course if I decide to sell the car I could always just swap them out and sell this separately if you guys really want to go the inexpensive route of not paying the $59 you could always buy like Plasti Dip or any other like paint coat or black paint coat and just spray them out taking them out and putting them in is actually really easy to do i'll go ahead and show you guys just a heads up guys uh you gotta be very careful when you're taking these bezels out because the clips that hold on to this are pretty sensitive and under a lot of pressure could snap and there's really no other way of fixing that so just be mindful when you're doing that So guys, I just finished installing the passenger side lights. And as you guys can see, it looks significantly different from the chrome stock bezels. What I definitely noticed that this mod definitely adds a lot more depth or amplifies the black taillight tints that look really, really nice with the gloss black spoiler that I have. I mean, this is the look that I'm trying to go for, guys. It's really great because I've actually been wanting to uh, de-chrome, you know, darken out, blacken out my car over the next coming weeks. So this is something that, again, uh, I'm really kind of excited to do. And I am seeing a noticeable difference uh, from my previous setup that I had. So uh, let's go ahead and install the rest. So there you guys have it. All four of the bezels are installed. This is the final result and it looks delicious. And it's actually meeting every single expectations that I had for this install. Unfortunately, I still think that 59, almost 60 bucks is still on the higher side of things. Not the best price, I'll admit that, but I definitely am not as regretful now that they're installed and it looks just really, really nice. Well guys, there you have it. Those are seven inexpensive mods that are $50 or below that you could buy for your Camaro SS and some of them for the Camaro RS. If you found this video informative and entertaining, go ahead and give this video a like. It definitely helps out with the algorithm for anybody looking to find really cheap and really cool mods that uh, will definitely transform the look of their car. Guys, don't forget 
forget to hit the subscribe button if you enjoy my content uh, overall. And guys, don't forget to hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos, my reviews, my how-tos, my vlogs, or any of these type of videos. Guys, thank you so much for watching and I will catch you next time.